Right, welcome to a drink tasting video. It is um, like just after one o'clock. I was kind of like in sceptic of how to do things like whether to do a walk and then meet my dad at the pet shop and then like um, after that I don't know. But it was basically, but basically the plan is what he was doing is he's, he's going to drive down, do that there, and then come back. Then he can shower. Then. Um, Go out together, we'll go out together somewhere. What? Pardon me. It is ten past one. What I'm planning on doing actually is now film a video now and then as it's just getting to towards two o'clock, do another one. Um and the one thing I'm gonna try, and it's one thing I've had upstairs for a while, is ginger brie ginger pre ginger beer, uh sparkling ginger beer. Now the thing is I probably won't like this. I mean I've had ginger beer before. But I'm not like a total fan of it. Um, unless it's something I do genuinely end up liking and I end up having it at work. Ginger beer, it's even the flavour. It's like I'm not a fan of the flavour. Because it's like a very fiery, fiery flavour. You know, it's something you can have, but not quite often. Oh, that's like like a warm feeling there. It's like a weird feeling, like. Right? Yeah, it's something I could have, but not on the regular. If I was like, okay, if I, if that was what there was, I could have that. It's basically like eating very strong gingerbread biscuits. Like the very the very strong ones. I'm like I'm kind of okay with that, but like I wouldn't have it again. Like I'm just leaning over because I've got an itchy foot. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have that, and I've, what I've also got is a tensing, which I'm gonna have later on. I might just probably film that in like ten minutes time, like to get rid of the taste of this. I've never really been a fan of ginger beer. So, like, yeah, it's not, me mum bloody loves the stuff, I mean, I can't, it's like suffocation here, I, I don't like that feeling at all, it's like, it's like someone's just like, inside strangling you, I'm like, I don't want that, you don't want that from a drink, uh, some people can tolerate the taste of it, some people, like, can't, and I can't, I don't like, don't, I'm not a fan of that, it's making me feel a bit weird, actually, Ooh. So one thing I'm going to do is I'd literally just turn the heating off thinking I was going to be out now for like an hour to meet my dad at the pet shop. But actually what I've done is turned it back on, put another timer back on and whatever's on the wash, whatever the, whatever's out on the washing line now, the stuff on the wash, the stuff on the radiators now, which are just drying, uh, they're not too far off being dry really. But, like, what I'm going to do is slowly get stuff done. Because, like, when I came home yesterday, I was just like, wow, there's a lot, there was a lot done. Um, a lot physically done. So, like, I think my dad's going to put a, I think either me, my dad, my mum's going to put a fire on tonight. So, we're going to have that. And we can have whatever's outside on the area. And it can just be over, overnight. And what I need to do is tomorrow I'm on a walk, I need to walk the dogs in the morning before I go to work, because I start at 10 o'clock. I was originally, I was originally actually on a day off, then I'd been put on a 7-2 shift for that day, and then basically I said, well I can't do 7-2 shift, but I can start later on, so they said the best we can do is a 10 o'clock start, and I'm like, yeah, that's fine, that's good for me. Um, I've also got that as well, which is like literally on here, just keeping cool. Because of my back, because, uh, ooh, that feels chilly. Ah, yeah, yeah. Because of my back having problems, uh, having like the problem where I've been having, um, the cold, like the, the, the pain, like not, not pain as such, but like the, like, irritation on my back. Um, I've been putting that on my back lately. Oh, that's actually stuck on there a little bit. 
sort of. <laughs> um, so what I'm doing is kind of just leaning, like laying down onto this. Um, because I can't like properly balance that up to me to be back right now. Um, because the two things that work are you've got cooling freeze spray, soothing heat spray. So this is basically deep freeze. That's deep heat. That's deep heat. But the basically they are just they're just cheaper versions. And the idea is is to like for like a few days. So up to a week just spray this on your back and then for the other week pretty much just spray that on your back because what what this does is reduces the tissue from growing on your net on your back and like potentially like um yeah i mean just have a look uh, Cools, soothes, and relaxes most muscular joint and aches. Can be used after sport or exercise. So yeah, this is down at the uh, what do you call it? Uh, doctors, not doctors. What's it called? Chemist. And they're literally selling this alongside like Tiger Balm and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm gonna once these are being used up, I'm gonna go down and get some more. So, I'm going to wrap up the video to turn them around. So, thanks for watching for now, and, um, yeah. Goodbye.